Hello everybody and welcome back to another exciting episode of Pokemon Coliseum. And if you do enjoy this content, please like, comment, or subscribe, and if you follow the link in the description to my Patreon page to become a patron for one dollar, that'd be greatly appreciated. So, here we go again, back into the fray. Wait. Um, so, don't get, let me get this straight. Oh, never mind. <laughs> well, I feel stupid, but anyway. Maybe the place to heal. Oh boy. Well, if it isn't you again, you had your way with my party before, but not this time. Okay. I don't know what you're talking about. If anything, you all look the same, so, um... Yeah, okay. Wait. No. I was just like, wait a minute. Yeah, is he talking about me? Because I saw Fortress, I'm like, oh, okay. But no. It's all good. <laughs> it's all good. What I'm going to do is going to be confidential. Will it? I don't know. Suicune will come out, Frelicator will do rain dance, and guess what? Hit two birds with one stone with a double whammy of surf. I guess. <laughs> Excuse me. That's, uh. That's not good. I mean, it's not bad, but it's not good either. Sorry, just thinking about it, thinking, um, like, where's the benefit of that in the reality as well? There is a benefit to that. Um, well, the benefit of that is, well, Fortress is now a literal tank on defense. But special defense, that's something much to be desired. And that's where my logic is, focus on the special defense with Fortress, and you'll be solid. That is the rule. Kind of. Wow, that... I could have just used Surf, but it's like, no, let's go super effective, even though Truth be told didn't do too much damage. Now I can double whammy on with Surf. I mean, I'm not sure which one's more strong, which one's stronger in special attack. Okay. But it's still kind of like, well... Times. Anyway, let's see what happened. Okay, so they're relatively similar in terms of power, in terms of special attack. So it's like, okay, let's. All right. Uh, yeah, power beam and then surf. The great thing about this in this situation, well. Um, Cutify is not really the more evasive type. Okay. <clears throat> He's trying to hit with the uh, attack. Well, screwed. Kind of. I can clearly see what his type is. It's a dust tox, I swear. Okay. And the reason why I'm making that prediction is it's like, well, I know what it was. I know what it. Okay, never mind. Stand corrected. I mean, it's not the first time I've been wrong, so. Spikes. I don't plan on bringing out any other Pokemon as said in the belt. So. Yeah. Alright, so she's gonna lower a beam again and surf Relegator. Only reason, because it's like you're dealing with a steel bug and the rest are flying bug. So. Yeah, and this one's the toughest of the two, because it's a, a fairly well-balanced one. Great. Fairly well-balanced in terms of defensive capabilities. The fortress, well, as you can, is, you can tell from its name, is pretty... Okay. Its name is pretty straightforward. It means it's a tank in terms of defensive capabilities. Now, not that I need to, not that I need to bury that in terms of logic over and over again. But anyway, just, that's just how it is. And 
I'd like to sew up, so anything I'd use that's physical will be literally half damage, so yeah. Not worth it. And Freligator is a tank when it comes down to that. To a degree. You lived up to your reputation. Yeah. I did. I did, I did, I did. I did. Okay. Bye. Alright. So I'm gonna these two Pokemon. We'll get these two Pokemon taken care of. Alright. I mean, since they were used, like, heavily, it's like, yeah. Well, I mean, I'm thinking about it using a um, Tyranitar, but at the same time, not at the moment, because you don't see there. Mainly because it's just not the time for that. But, yeah, we'll have to wait and see. No, oh, no, okay. Now, the only reason I'm doing this is so that way um, so that way my Pokemon can get healed. It's actually very efficient. It's actually pretty cool. Alright. Because then, well, I mean, it, could, it can be faster or it can be a pain in the ass, one or the other. Whoops. No, I don't want to go to my PDA. Don't you tell me what to do. Alright, All right, cool. Now we're back in the game. Thinking for thinking for a moment. Okay. Ugh, what now? If it's him again, I'm like, oh my gosh. Oh, it's Ned. Never mind. Pokemon list. Hi, it's Ned. I analyzed the Pokemon Pokemon list again and discovered six more. The the additions are Tyranitar, Mistrevious, Slugma, Slugma, Smut. Smartle, Absol, and Heracross. Send you. <clears throat> I'm gonna say this right now. It took you how long to make this list? I mean, seriously, how long did it take? And Heracross. Oh my gosh, I have it already. You think for one moment, huh? Let's look in his. Let's look in his his boxes. No, no, no. I'm just gonna assume that you haven't caught it yet. Yep, Mistrevious. Whatever. Anyway. For me, for me. There we go. Oh yeah, more ethers. Like I need more of those. But anyway. Something back here? Nope. Okay. Am I gonna pop out of here? Nope. Okay. And hello. <laughs> hello, um, sir. I'm sure you know me, but I'm Causal. Sounds like you've been playing here all over the place. Playtime's over. I'll reduce you to to the same star sorry state as this snag machine lab. Okay. Alright, we're gonna get to it then. It just kinda winds up and throws. I can't remember what it's called. It's basically the evolved form of Rovile, that's it. When you hear it enough times from the Pokemon the anime series, it's like it's um it's supposed to stick. Not in this situation. Eh, nope, nope, nope. I mean, if anything, Rovile was probably one of his favorite Pokemon, I think. That is super effective, to the point where Rhyhorn is no more. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna, nope, we're gonna, okay, here we go. Alright, whatever, let's do, you do what you do, I don't care. No, not crushing the wall. Okay then, I see where you're going with this now. Well, okay then, that did some superb damage.
so dramatic. Okay. Really? Wow. Well, all right then. I have a way around that. Try your crush claw now, bitch. Ah! Oh my gosh, I don't know why I got a kick out of that one. Maybe because I called it. Okay. Wait, is that more? Is it not Zigzagoon? Or Z Zangoose, excuse me. It is a Zangoose. that I have is that I'm ahead by quite a bit. Now, the one thing is, uh, what's he kind of sad about? Um, normal Pokemon and... Okay. You know what? Never mind. I have no advantage in this situation. Especially after that. The Zangus can take out take out Mistrevis with only one hit. Only statement in this. Bullshit. Bullshit. But whatever. I should have let you surf it, bitch. Woof. I thought Zangoose was a strong Pokemon. Huh. Well, I've been wrong before. You're done. Alright. Furligator's nearly level 50, so that's a good thing. Stands a better chance with everything. Um, wickedly strong. Alright. I didn't think you'd be this tough. No wonder you're famous. Yeah. Alright. Uh, let's see. Found Max Revive. Okay. I'll use those if I have to, but right now I'm just gonna use what revives I have. Revive Hitmontop. And Mistrevis. Oh yeah, I'm just burning through that stuff, no problem. Hyper Potion. Hyper Potion! There we go. So now I'm back in the game. Oh, and I'm assuming... Rare Candy. Alright, I'm gonna assume that he's gonna come up. No? Interesting. What I meant by he, I meant by the... I meant by the, the Snagum leader, but I guess not. I, I mean, I might have fought wrong. I don't know. As these games always seem to portray these play, these hideouts as just nothing but a maze to which you have to figure it out, and it's like, ugh, really? But yeah, that's the norm. Yes. Okay. Yeah, you're in the right direction. Oh, hello. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. All right. Get one more battle in. There's gotta be some, some guts. Okay, there's gotta be some somewhere. Some Pokeballs holding awesome Pokemon. Do you have? Them? Are you serious? Do you have some? I'm sorry, I can't give them to you because, first of all, no. Just no. Dabra and Gucci. What are the odds of me losing? Hmm. Oh, whatever. Oh, we got another bone brain trainer here. Yep. Of course. Dabra always goes first because he's faster than, say, him. But, okay. Shit. The thing is the Freligate is not fast enough to outspeed um Kadabra, sadly. Okay. Hujiana's done. Take a seat. Oh, Alright, I'm going to 
if unfortunately he gets knocked out, well, too bad for me. Surfing. Are you serious? That is BS, I swear. Double team and both at that's at this point. Just do do the double surf, I guess, at that one at that point. Well okay. Oh, 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 oh. There's one move too late. why I don't like that Pokemon. Not only that, lower level teams always tend to... Well, what I mean by lower level teams, I mean teams like these that are... Like, bluntly, or have no strategies. Just like, oh no, we're gonna double team the strongest Pokemon we have. Or they have, and it's like, you know, it's a guaranteed win. No, it's not. Not entirely. But whatever. What do I know? I'm just a... I'm just a... A oh, cultured swine, what can I say? There we go. You're getting double teamed anyway, so it doesn't matter. You just it's so fair. It's like yes it is. At this point it's totally fair. And either way, Freligator and Suicune are relatively similar in terms of power. So Yeah. Alright. I knew you had some. Some awesome Pokemon. You were expecting me to give you some? Wrong. Where did you find those? I want some too. But you uh, piss off. All right. Ooh, cool. Three max potions. Max potions. All right. So I'm actually going to end the episode right here. So in the next episode, I'll just keep going. <laughs> keep going, wandering around the Snagum, Snagum team hideout. So yes. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you leave me a like, comment, or subscribe, that'd be greatly appreciated. Appreciated. And if you want to follow the link down in the description to my Patreon page and become a patron for one dollar, that'd be greatly appreciated. So, thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, I will see you guys next time.